Hillier joins us now with more on what you should recycle and what you should toss. Hi, Ron. Hello, Jill. There was a time when you, if you weren't sure whether or not to throw in the items with the recyclables to do so anyway and just hope that it would be recycled. But now there's been a change and they're saying if you're not sure about it, to take it and throw it out. China is the leading importer of recyclables, but new quality control measures in that country this year mean banning certain items and limiting the amount of trash or non-desired items to no more than 0.5 percent in a bale of delivery. There is material mixed in that's not what they're claiming to purchase. Um, they will reject it, which means it actually has to get shipped all the way back here. If deliveries are turned away, that could wreak havoc on the domestic recycling industry. One of the area's largest waste haulers and recyclers, Waste Management, is asking consumers and businesses to avoid putting foam, electronic and similar items into recyclable collections. This change has really come on rather quickly and it's something that we're looking to do in response to um, some of the challenges the recycling industry is facing. They say certain items like plastic bags can do more harm than good, so when in doubt, throw it out. If the bags still get through the process, they actually get stuck on some of the mechanics and the equipment during the sorting process and cause a huge issue throughout the line. In fact, the Erie County Sustainability Coordinator, Brittany Prashak, says contaminating your recycling collection could defeat your efforts. If it's highly contaminated, whether it's just plastic bags or more than just plastic bags, it might go to the landfill. We're not entirely sure, but it may go there just because it's too costly to even try and process. For now, the request to get rid of plastic bags is enforced with business owners, but not for residential and other municipal collection. If you have plastic bags like this, you're encouraged to reuse them or take them back to stores that have collection boxes. Also, you can go and find out what the practices are for your particular municipality on your Erie.com. Jill? Okay, good advice. Thank you, Ron.